Hi friends, uh, this is our lesson for this week. Um, you'll notice that it looks different than the picture lessons that I was doing before, but this is um, another type of godly play story, and it is from the Bible, um, John chapter 10. Jesus talked about being the good shepherd. There's, um, it's also from the Bible in Psalms number 23, when there's a beautiful description of God as our shepherd. So this story brings those words, God's words in the Bible, um, kind of brings them to life for us. And it also overlaps those words with some of the things that we do together at church. Um, so last week when we talked about Jesus sending his spirit to the disciples, that was so he could, so the disciples could tell the whole world. And that's the birthday of the church, the birth of our church all around the world. And so it's interesting for us to see the shape that the church, that the church took as it's growing. Um, and so this story will kind of touch on all those things. Even if you have seen or heard some of this story before, it can be nice to allow yourself to rest in the story so there will be quiet moments and that's not a mistake that's a chance for us to simply watch and be still before god there once was a man who did such amazing things and said such wonderful things that people just had to ask him who he was. Jesus said, I am the good shepherd. He said, I know each one of my sheep by name. And my sheep know the sound of my voice. When I take the sheep from the sheepfold. They follow me. I show them the way to the good grass.
This is the table of the Good Shepherd. Sometimes people want to add a lot of things to make this table look fancy, and that's okay. But here is the bread and the wine, and that's really all you need. Because the Good Shepherd is in the bread and the wine. Sometimes someone comes and they read the words of the Good Shepherd they give us the bread and the wine of the Good Shepherd And then all the people come. There's room for everyone at the table of the Good Shepherd. children come. Now, I wonder if you have ever come close to a table like this. Do you think the people around this table are happy? I wonder if you've ever come close to the bread and the wine. I would love to hear what you think about this story in our Zoom call. Thanks for joining me.